where do sticky bums come from? Where do sticky bums come from? My dad and I go to Johnny's Sticky Buns to get cinnamon buns every Saturday. My favorite bun isn't a bun at all. I get the monkey brains with icing on the side. Dad sips on coffee and we read books about space, superheroes, and cartoon tigers. Saturdays are the best. One Saturday, I found a new book. Dad, Dad, hmm, do you know where sticky buns come from? Are they pulled from the ground? or caught in the sea? Are they formed deep in space? Or picked from a tree? Do they fall from the sky? Or fly over from France? Are they conjured by magic? Ta-da! Dr. Johnny's buns from nothing and other delicious illusions. Meet the famous bun men. Or made by chance. Wait! That's not where sticky buns come from. Right. They are made by a baker who mixes the flour and kneads the dough, who rolls out the buns, and bakes them just so. And that's where sticky buns come from. Not yet. What about monkey brains? How are they made? We're not finished yet, so let's turn the page. When the baker has baked the last of his batch, there's something he does to make use of the scraps. He chops them all up, every last one, and makes something new with a bit of each bun. Once you have learned to use all of your dough, there won't be a limit to where you can go. When you use what you have to make something new, you'll be a baker. Sticky buns come from you. We started the next day while Johnny's was closed. We mixed up some flour and dirtied our clothes. We monkeyed around, we followed directions, and baked up some buns with careful attention. Now I'm where sticky buns come from. And then here everyone's the recipe, but I will take a picture of it and put it online for you. This is my kids, one of my kids' favorite books, and I now make sticky buns all the time. So your newest assignment is to make your own sticky buns. Good luck.